Hello everybody, this is Angga Rizky and welcome back to my video. In this video, I'm gonna to show you how to install the framework bootstrap for our project. So, I have prepared the mine files for you. This is the frame of bootstrap for you guys. Uh, sorry, this is a bootstrap framework for you. I have put the CSS, fonts, image. This is a sample image for our project. Okay. And the last is JavaScript. I have put the jQuery right here so you don't get access this jQuery from internet or CDN. You can access this jQuery from your local host. Okay. And in this case, I'm using the Sublime Text Editor for our editor. So I'm using the sublime text right here. You can download it from the official site. This is the sublime text editor.com. Okay. And then I just need to drag my folder. I will drag this file into the text editor. Okay guys, now I will make it maximize like this. Okay, this is the editor and inside of editor, we have put the bootstrap framework. Okay. And the next step is create a new file for our index.html so we will create the landing text using the index.html okay by the way I will install the framework bootstrap first sorry I will install the bootstrap framework then after that we can develop our website using this framework okay so you just need to click right right here into your mouse and then new file then you can go into file and save and give the name of file is index.html okay now the basic things you need to do is only create the document type like this okay it's enough and then you can create the title for your website right here my project where is under key okay and then we include the bootstrap framework in our XML using the name headstrap is CSS and we can view the pet location right here going to bootstrap.css and the type is text or CSS Okay, then we can save it like this. Okay, guys. And now we just need to include the our JavaScript from a uh, Bootstrap framework. So we need to include them in our project. We create the script and give the source src it's mean a source and going to folder of gs 
and then jQuery main dot gs okay and next we just need copy this line of codes we can change this extension to be bootstrap at this case okay then I will testing our framework okay so we will test the framework using the basic component from a bootstrap framework just make sure our framework it's work okay so we create the well and give the head tree or header title of tree is hello bootstrap then we can save it okay and the next I will testing in to my browser using a uh, Google Chrome okay still loading of file we just need to take off moment okay so this is not working I don't know why we can check it out so mm, okay well we need to check it out okay guys so I'm sorry I forget about the include to our bootstrap using the style sheet so you just need to in rel style sheets like this then we can save it and trying to refresh again okay this is the component of bootstrap the name is well okay so you can create the container right here then wrong like this and give the header to is bootstrap framework and the below of header to is lauren ipsum okay we set it then try again Take this case okay congratulations you have success to install the bootstrap framework so in the next video I will show you how to create the customize of stylesheet so we have the CSS right here in the later of video we will learn about create the customize of CSS for bootstrap framework okay so goodbye and see you